<laughs> this is, I just have to do this. Here I am, uh, this, this visual is for the Brunetti, the MC2 uh, combo 60 watt Italian made uh, amp. When I do these things, I don't know what I'm going to do, what I'm going to say. Half the time I'm not even in tune. That good. In other words, I'm just trying to show you the, the amp. And uh, this is a 78 Les Paul. It's a nice guitar. But it's everybody owns something like this. This isn't a 30,000 hour guitar. That, of course, you know, they would kick butt. My real 59 or PAFs. But I'm just using a regular guitar. I, I'm just going to wing it. Here's the amp. Uh, right now we're in crunch with the edge on. The edge is pretty neat. Here it is with it. Here's without it. This is all my opinion. I do the best I can, and I do what I want because I can. So when I go to hear something, I ain't the best player, but I know tone. I'd rather hear something like that than somebody that's very good playing, playing with a backing track and three effects. Yeah, they play good. Yes, they're in time. Yes, they're unreal. But they're not hearing the amp. You're hearing the backing track. 
to kick butt guitar, the Unreal Artist, I'm not knocking them, and three effects. I'm playing with a straight amp. I got the reverb on like one, but I gotta like get a little something. I always say like that guitar player from the Edge, yes he's great. Give him that Vibrolux over there in a Strat, no toys. Let's see how famous he is.